has a beautiful swimming pool, ladders down into the pool, beautiful collection of um, wooden sun lounges, soft cushion tops all at the back of the pool area here. How much are the sun beds for rental? For rental 50,000 rupee with tower also. Yeah, we there's your swimming pool area here at the Wurtopora and then we have another promenade here leading out into the oceans you've got gazebos um, on both sides here and there's your beautiful pool area have a poolside bar just to the left there and there's your swimming pool here at the Gria Santrian all along the back and there's another angle on your swimming pool look at this, there's a drinks now a seating area here also on the beach for a new pool. You can rent the swimming pool for the day, 50,000 per person, including one soft drink, pool, pool. Good afternoon from Bali, Indonesia. So today I'm here in Sonor and what I'm going to feature in today's video for you is a beach walking tour from Kerang Beach through to Sindhu Beach. Okay, so featured in today's video is going to be a walking tour from Kerang Beach all the way through to Sindhu Beach. So featured in the video, I'm going to feature um, a great collection of resorts and hotels along the way. I'll take you in and show you the swimming pool areas of the resorts and hotels that we pass on this walk. Um, there's also going to be a great collection of restaurants, warung, bar, shopping options, massage on the beach, all you could possibly want from a holiday here in Sonor should you be staying close to the beach. So without any further ado, let's go and get started and share with you a walking tour from Kerang to Sindhu Beach. Okay, so this is the start point for today's video. We have Bamboo Blonde straight across the street. Just up here we have Swastika Bungalows. Just directly across the road we have Forchetta Italian Restaurant. We have Billy's Cafe on the corner here. Just on the opposite side we have Caf Small Gas. And then now we're going to head down this street towards Kerang Beach. So just on the left here we have Yulia 2 Homestay. It's just in the back there. Now we're going to continue walking down the street towards Kerang Beach. Okay, so just after walking down from the main street of Jalandana Tambalingan for about 40 or 50 meters, we have a place called Nayuman Kadai Coffee here, small little coffee shop. Show you some of what's on the coffee menu here. Nice collection of coffees and cappuccinos, soft drinks available also. Nice seating area inside, there's a counter area at the back, nice seating area here, some beautiful tables and chairs there also. Okay so just from Newman Kadai coffee shop now we're going to continue walking down the street to uh, Kerang Beach. Okay so just after walking in a straight line from Newman Kedai coffee shop, it's next in line on our way to the beach, this is a place called Wanti, Villa Wantilamputi. This is the gate entrance, I've covered this in a separate video, that's the name. And then we're going to continue walking in a straight line. Okay, so after walking in a straight line now from Villa Wantilamputi, now we've arrived at the um, parking area and the market stall areas. So parking for motorbikes is 2,000, parking for cars is 5,000. I'm going to pay, make payment to this guy sat on the um, chair, plastic chair in the corner here. And then just as we enter here now, this is where the um, local market stalls are located. So a nice collection of ladies clothes and things in there I see. It's 
some magnets, some swimming things for the kids, some rubber rings, some stubby holders, some hats to protect you from the sun, some balls, buckets and spades for the beach. Here's your motorbike and car parking area, motorbikes here, cars are located in the back. And we have more, um, more things here for the kiddies. Lots of inflatables available for playing in the ocean. Nice collection of hats and caps and things. Hello, good afternoon. Just in the back corner there, we have a small warung selling simple food, coconuts and soft drinks and beers. And then now we've arrived at Karang Beach. Okay, so we'll just continue forward now and then we'll come back onto the path and continue walking along the beach. I'll just show you the beach area in this location. So we have a little um, promenade with a um, gazebo on the end here leading out into the beach have a little seller here selling some like Indonesian snacks hello, hello. <laughs> so here's a promenade the start of a promenade leading out into the ocean the gazebo there's the beach on the right hand side all the fishing boats in the ocean and this beautiful promenade here leading out to a um, gazebo area on the end There's your beach on the left hand side and just in the back there we have a gazebo area. Okay so just back on the uh, pathway now at the back of the beach just on the right hand side here now we have some bicycles for rent so now's a great place if you want to rent your bicycles so this lady has some new ones here some kiddies adults with child seats also in the back there how much are the bicycles, madam? 40,000 for one hour. 40,000 for one hour. And do you rent them for the day or yes. how much for the day? Uh, one day 150. One day 150. So 150 for one day. These are very new bikes. You also have, is it the same price for the ones with the kiddie seat? Same price. Same price for the ones with the kiddie seat there. And we also have some for children here. Okay, so just down from a lady with the um, bicycle rental there, just around about 50 metres. We have an area here where you can rent your sunbeds. So there's also a guy here selling some tours and fer um, fer ferry tickets and things to the islands. There's the name. Hello, good afternoon, sir. How are you? Very well. How much are the sunbeds for rental? For rental, 50,000 rupee with towel also. Yeah, we have shower and toilet for free. Okay. Also, we can serve drink and food menu here. Is that 50,000 for one day? Yeah, until you finish. We not charge hour by hour. Okay, thank you, sir. Let me just show your chairs. Yeah. So here they are, the wooden sun lounges, soft cushion tops. Also have the umbrella to protect you from the sun. And we'll just take you through and show you your beach location here. Okay, so just next to his office, he also has some paddle boards for rental here. These are 150,000 for the hour. So just next door to a tourist information guy and the sun beds for uh, rental. Here we have the 101 Hotel. And um, this is your beach location if you're staying at the 101 Hotel. So these are all free for guests staying at the 101 Hotel. Synthetic sun lounges, soft cushion tops. So just next door to the 101 Hotel seating area, we have another place here called Happy Bar. Free drink tomorrow. So this place um, serves food and drink and they also have the sun lounges available for rent as well here. Wooden sun lounges, soft cushion tops.
Have a little beach swing as well there. Nice section of beach. Okay, so just from a collection of sun lounges now here, just at the back of the beach, we have a Villa Pantai Kerrang. Okay, so we'll just take you inside Villa Pantai Kerrang. The name above the door. I've covered this place already in a video, however in today's video we'll just give you a look around the swimming pool area. There's a beautiful swimming pool, ladders down into the pool, beautiful collection of um, wooden sun lounges, soft cushion tops all at the back of the pool area here. Have a beautiful seating area over to the left there, some more like bathing pools in the back here. And all the rooms are located in the back there. nice seating area in the back here also I'll just show you this one on this side and here's another angle on your pool okay so just coming out of Villa Pantai Kerrang now just in the back here we have a place called Creamer this is like a coffee and drink shop it also sells food just in the back there and then they have a nice collection of tables and chairs on the beach okay so just from creamer just up this little um, pathway here this is the Lang Howie Hotel also a little coffee shop there as well nice seating area here outside have a special promo on Here's your beach lounging area outside the Langhawi. Nice big wide section of beach here. Okay, so just from a seating area or lounging area outside the Langhawi Hotel and the Calf Creamer. Just right in the back of the uh, beach now, we have a place called the Word Hapora. And just cut across here onto the bath walking, uh, the bike track at the back of the beach. This isn't really for pedestrians. So this is the Word Hapora Hotel in the back. Also has a restaurant here out on the beach. Show you some of the menu available. Also have some smoothies available here at the World Hapora. Also some milkshakes. So just from a seating area at the restaurant area at the World Hapora. Now we just continue walking along the track. So there's the name there. And now we have this beautiful big swimming pool area here. There's your swimming pool area here at the Word Hapora. Okay, so just from the Word Hapora now, so I'm back on the um, pedestrian footpath area. Just at the back here, we have a massage on the beach. You can have your massage right on the beach here. Have some more bicycles and things for rental here. Hello, how much are the bicycles? Like chicken, 25 for an hour. 25 for an hour and for one day? No, one hour. Only one day, only one hour? Yes. Okay. So 25,000 for one hour for the bicycle rental here. And then just in the back here, we have a place called Nalayan. <laughs> so just at the back of the Nalayan seating area here, we have an inside seating area also. There's the name on the wall. Let's take you around and show you this beautiful inside seating area also. Okay, so this is the Nalayan in the back here. 
This is the beach area, beautiful white sand beach here. And then we have another promenade here leading out into the oceans. You've got gazebos um, on both sides here. And this is your beach area on the other opposite side. Okay, so just from a promenade leading out into the ocean there. Now I'm back on the beach and at the back of the beach on the track again. The next place in line is going to be a place called Villa Shanty. Nice little um, sun lounger area here. Not sure if this is connected with the Villa Shanty or not. A raised platform area here also with some tables and chairs. It's a Villa, Villa Shanty restaurant dining area at the back here. There's your sun loungers outside Villa Shanty. That's the name there. So we just got permission to take you inside and show you the Villa Shanty Beach Hotel swimming pool area. A nice gazebo area here also. Nice seating areas. And there's your beautiful pool area. Okay, so just back outside the Villa Shanty Beach Hotel now. We'll just show you the beach area here at the Villa Shanty. Here's the sun loungers. And then here's your, here's your beach area. So just at the back of the uh, Villa Shanty lounger area, they also have a massage here in the back. Show you some of the treatments available. It's all in the back there. So just next door to Villa Shanty, we have a Bali Japan massage in the back there. That's full with customers, so I don't want to go too close. And then just next in line, this is the um, Gria Santrian. So this is the dining area here at the Gria Santrian. It's just in the back there, or in the front there by the beach. We'll just walk along the pathway here. So we have a dining facility area in the side there also. We have these nice lounging areas here also under the umbrellas. Have a poolside bar just to the left there and there's your swimming pool here at the Gria Santrian. So just coming out of the Gria Santrian now from the swimming pools, lots of guests staying here. Many of the sun loungers fully occupied. Here's the entrance to the Gria Santrian here. We have arena seaside here, this looks like a calf or something just to the side there. So just continuing on, we'll just show you some of the happy hour cocktails here. We have a beautiful seating area inside there. all agree a sanctuary and seating area here and we just continue on along the pathway okay so next on the left hand side here we have the Basaki Beach Hotel this is your sun lounger relaxing area outside of the Basaki Beach Hotel this is the dining area We'll just show you the beach area first at the Basaki and then we'll take you and show you the swimming pool. So we have a nice collection of synthetic sun lounges here, soft cushion tops also. All these nice flags here. And then this is your beach location outside the Basaki Hotel. Okay, so just at the back of the Basaki Beach Beach, uh, beach um, Hotel seating area, 
we'll just show you that it's the Basaki Beach Hotel. And there's your swimming pool here at the Basaki Beach Hotel. Okay, so just from the Basaki Beach Hotel now, turning around, so there's a lounges outside the Basaki Beach Hotel. Just in the back here, we have a tourist information office where you can book your tours and things. There's some of the daily activities available. Also can book your um, ferry tickets to the islands of Nusa Penedia, Nusa Lembongan, maybe Gili also here. Some different packages available. Just in the back there we have Basaki massage, the ladies there are just doing two people's hair. Have some more bicycles for rental here. Hello. Hello. Just in just in how much is how much is the bike? For one day? One, one hour. One hour for one day? One day uh, 70. One day 70. Okay, thank you. Just at the back here we have a nice little um, ladies clothing shop. Some nice ladies clothing here. Also some bags I see in the back. Some barley bag us bags there. Some bikinis. Just continue on along the way here, under the ladies' clothing. Next on the left here, this is the uh, Tandung, Tanjung Sari. Beautiful gateway entrance into the Tanjung Sari. It's a nice restaurant, with a swimming pool in the back there also. And then here's your seating area outside the Tanjung Sari. Nice, uh, beautiful, clean, flat white sand beach area. Nice collection of tables and chairs, some wooden sun lounges, soft cushion tops. <laughs> Just take you to the front and show you your ocean. Here's a pan from right to left. Okay, so just from a Tanjung Sari beach area now, we're going to continue walking along the track. All the people on the uh, bicycles here, very popular in Sonora, riding the bicycle. Next in line, we have a place called Memory Sonora. Some more beach house here. It's maybe for rent there in the back. And this is a place called Memory Sonor. This is like a restaurant and coffee shop. It also has its own little swimming pool area. So just from the Memory swimming pool area there. Also have a seating area here on the beach. You have to watch yourselves with the bicycles. Take you through and show you here. Nice tables and chairs here. Also have a nice swing here. And here's your beach location outside of Memories. Okay, so just at the back of the beach again now from Memories Beach location, just show you some of what's available here. There's some of the beers, wines, some of the drinks, cocktails, coffees, juices. Okay, so just moving on from memories now, there's a um, platform leading out towards the ocean. Just here, this is the um, gazebo, um, beach, beach cottage and villas is going to be next. There's a seating area outside for the restaurant. 
Here's the name. Gazebo. Okay, so we'll just show you some of the menu here at Warung Gazebo. Very reasonably priced food this is. Indonesian dishes, some drinks at the bottom there. Okay, so the Gazebo Beach Hotel also has a special on the swimming pool. You can rent the swimming pool for the day, 50,000 per person, including one soft drink. Pool, pool towel is not included. Okay, so here's your swimming pool area here at the Gazebo Hotel. So here's the far end of the Gazebo Beach Hotel swimming pool. Nice big swimming pool. Have a collection of sun loungers all along the back there. Okay, so just from the Gazebo Beach Hotel now, we'll take you and show you the Gazebo Beach Hotel beach location. There's a nice collection of tables and chairs here on the beach. Also some la sun loungers up at the front here. Synthetic sun loungers, soft cushion tops. And then here's your beach location here at the gazebo. Okay, so just down on the uh, pathway from the Gazebo Beach Hotel, around about 70 metres, next in line, we have the Rispati Beach Hotel. This is the restaurant area here that we can see now. Nice collection of table and chairs. Just show you some of the menu available here. Breakfast menu. Some more menu here at the Rispati. I'll just take you through now and show you the swimming pool area. So we have more seating areas, tables and chairs here to the left. More to the right there also. Here's a swimming pool area. So in the back here we have these beautiful gazebos with a nice seating or lounging areas underneath there. Oh, oh sorry, sorry sir. <laughs> and there's another angle on your swimming pool. Okay, so just coming out of the Rispati now. This is your beach location here at the Rispati. Let's take you down the stairs. Nice collection of wooden um, lounges, soft cushion tops, umbrellas. And then here's your beach location at the Rispati. Okay, so just from our Rispati Beach Hotel um, area now, next in line here, we have a convenience store just on the side here, and then just next in line we have a place called Anjani Restaurant. We'll just take you around and show you the tables and chairs inside. They also have a beach seating area outside also. Also some fresh coconuts available, there's the name. And then we have some nice seating um, area here inside. Okay, so we'll just so, show you some of the menu here at the Anjani restaurant. This is one of the favourites here. Also some chicken wings. We'll just give you some prices on the other foods available here and then we'll show you the uh, curry prices also on the next page. Here's some more beautiful dishes on this um, side also, just the pictures to get your appetite going. And then here's the prices. Also give you some of the drinks prices as well available here, very reasonable prices these for the beach. Also some nice juices available there. 
And I know this is going to be important to many. Here's the prices of the beers. Also have some wines as well. Okay, so just from the Anjani restaurant now, there's also a seating area out at the um, back here on the uh, beach. These are 60,000 for two people for the day. If you want towels um, included in that price also, two towels, it's 100. Plastic with soft cushion tops, also some th synthetic, wooden with soft cushion tops, umbrellas. And then here's your beach location. Okay, so just at the back of the Anjani restaurant here, have this beautiful grass dividing the um, bicycle and a pedestrian footpath. And then this is the start of the new mall that's going to be here in um, Sonor now. These are the apartments here. La la, these look fan every dozy. 800 square meters. Wow, that's some size. And then there's a look at the complex. Okay, so just on from the Anjani, which is just here. There's a look at your beach. So this is the new mall in Bali, Icon Bali. It's got its own uh, swing out into the ocean there. And just here we have another promenade leading out into the ocean again. And then here's your beach on the other side now. This is um, entering the Sindhu area of Sonor now. Okay, so just down from the um, Icon Mall now. Just next in line here we have Kajora Suites. This is the door entrance into the back there. This is a look at Kajora Suites. Now they look on the inside, there's all the details, contact details in the bottom there. There's a look at what this place looks like. I'll show you the seating area now here at Kajora Suites. Synthetic lounges, however they're all laid on the side, don't know why. And here's your beach area outside Kajora Suites. So there's the promenade, what we showed you before, outside the Icon Mall. Okay, so just from Kajora Suites now, continuing on along the way, we'll go back onto, well, this is actually the bike path, however, I just want to show you this, um, the Sindhu market here in the back. So lots of little stores here along the way. And then here we have Welcome to Sindhu Beach Market. It's all down in the back there. So just next door to the Sindhu Beach Market, we have a place called Marino Benos. <laughs> Beautiful seating area inside. There's a bar area to the back there. And then here's the outside seating area on the beach. Some information here. Happy hour four till seven. And here's your beautiful seating area. So just next door to Mourinho Benos, we have some um, little clothing shops. He's uh, got a great collection of ladies clothing, it looks like. Inside there is a lady trying clothing on. Have Udin shop here. This guy's got hats. Some sandals in the back there also. Many pairs of sandals. Some fireworks. All has a collection of watches, bracelets. Many different things available there. So we're just moving on from Udin shop now. I have a tourist booking office here. Really? It's a place you can get all organise all your tours from and things. There's the contact details on there. Hello, how are you sir?
Many different adventures available here. Wonderful Indonesia. So just from a tourist booking office, next in line we have Kayu Manis Seaside Sonor. Let's take you inside the Kayu Manis. Nice seating area to the right here. There's a bar area straight ahead. Nice seating area to the left there. So just outside the Cayo Manis, they also have a beautiful seating area outside. Two, 2024. There's a collection of ice creams available here. And here's your beautiful seating area, just overlooking the ocean. Okay, so just next door to the Cayu Manis, we have Soul on the Beach. I love Bali, I'm never coming home. Let's take you around and show you inside Soul on the Beach. This is a very popular restaurant, this. Nice collection of wooden tables and chairs, beautiful decoration on the wall. There's a seating area inside. Here's a bar counter area at the back. So Soul on the Beach also has its own, uh, look at this, there's a drinks now. A seating area here also on the beach, very beautiful. So what's available here. Welcome to Soul on the Beach. Okay, so just next door to Seoul on the beach, we have a little uh, massage spa place called DD Reflexology. It's just in the back there. We'll just give you some idea of what treatments are available here. So there's the name up above. And there's the treatments available here. So just from DD Reflexology, just on the beach here, we have some more uh, massage on the beach. We have Katrina Massage. So this is just a simple bed here on the beach, the massage. And then we also, just next door, we have Sindhu Beach Massage. So treatments available here. And then you can just simply have a massage on the beach, on the beds overlooking the ocean okay so just from these massage ladies here now i want to show you this um, beach area this is sindhu beach this is a very popular beach area it's very very busy here many people in the ocean many people sat on the sand many people relaxing so just from a massage ladies and a first section of sindhu beach just in the back here this is the inner sindhu hotel resort and then just continuing along the track now, we're going to come to a nice collection of Warungs here. It's very busy here with people. So here's all of your Warungs in the back here, many all along the back. And as you can see, there's many customers. So just on the other side now of the Warungs, continuation of the seating, some under the shade here. So all the Warungs in the back and then just next in line here, we have Welcome to Sindhu Turtle Conservation. So just in here, these all these tanks in here are going to be full with turtles, many different sizes of turtles. The big ones usually over to the side there. I have some smaller ones here, some medium sized ones on the side there. And then to enter here, you've got a donation to make in the box there. So just from the um, Sindhu Turtle Conservation Centre, now we have a promenade leading out into the beach. There's all the Warung seating area busy section of beach and then we have another section of beach on this side that's also very very busy 
Okay, so we've come to the end of the video now. There's the Pantai Sindhu beach sign. Just at the back here, we have a nice collection of um, tourist goods markets. This is your land um, Pantai Sindhu. You find many hotels, restaurants along the street there, also bars, also some um, tourist goods shops along the side. Uh, continuation of the path in that direction.